Hey world, it's Terry with 2Fab, and we're here with Mike from Shaws of Sunset. Welcome, Mike. Hello. Thank you for uh, taking some time to be with us. Absolutely, my pleasure. I love 2Fab. Awesome, and thank you. And uh, thanks for uh, providing entertainment <laughs> at this uh -huh. time, because this season's been pretty crazy, huh? You know, I would say arguably the best season of Shaws in all eight years of filming the show, this has been the best one. Sure, it's, it's awesome. How, not how's, so much, I'm sorry, go ahead. No, go ahead. Not just so much because of the drama. I mean, that's great. You know, there's, there's a lot of like exciting stories that are happening in, in that world of, of, of dramaticness, but just the growth that the group is seeing, um, you know, we're all evolving and it's just, it's so fun to see, like looking back how young we were and the things that mattered then and the shit that matters now is like so much different and it's exciting to see where our lives are going to end up. Do you see... Do you, where do you see Gigi's and MJ's relationship going? With Golnessa and MJ, they've been friends for so long. There's too much history to just say, I'm done. I'm hanging up my, my, my coat and, you know, I'm never going to that party again. Because the friendship is, is still evolving. I think now they have something in common. You know, Golnessa just gave birth. Yep. Um, and when was, wait, when was that? That was yesterday. Yesterday, right? Yeah, she just gave birth. Um, so she's doing okay. He's doing great, dude. The baby is so cute. Has a cleft chin. Super cute nose. Really cute baby. You know, because when babies come out, they look like aliens. <laughs> all smashed up. This one came out like, like, <laughs> you know, I'm ready for the world. What's up? You know, I'm already handsome. Oh, that's <laughs> great. That's great. So, you know, I think once that maternity feeling inside of her kicks in and MJ's there by her side like yo girl I went through all this stuff here's what you do about this and whatever I think they'll find a common ground and they'll be able to mend their friendship that's great that's great to hear that and then she's doing great yeah she's doing amazing the baby's so cute I was just texting with her and Paulina today and really? we were just like oh my god like we can't wait to have one ourselves oh really yeah, oh, that's awesome. Yeah, you, are there are what what like wedding plans or what's? Um, I've been through it. I'm not really excited about doing that again. Yeah. Um, at this, we both have. So at this point, um, I'm more focused on building a family with her than having a piece of paper where the government tells me what I'm allowed and not allowed to do, and 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 to tell me what, you know, what I am as a as as a as a as a person. You know, whether you're single, uh, you know, or married, I, I don't need to check a box anywhere. It's just, it's something that me and her feel and we're good. That's cool. But that you, you are planning on having your own kids, huh? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. She makes beautiful babies. Um, she's an amazing mom. And as much as I love the two that we have to, that, that I, sh that I share with her, um, we want a few of our own. Sorry, still on. So is Gigi, did she, where did she have the baby, if you don't mind me asking? Was it in home or did she go to the hospital? No, no, no. What are we in the 50s, dude? No, baby. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about, bro? <laughs> I meant because of, you know. Yeah, Reza was playing catch. Like, all right, Gigi, push, push. Nah. Um, yeah, she, she was at a hospital. Thank God for insurance. Yeah. Uh, I think she was at Cedars. She had her baby. Um, She's healthy. The baby's healthy. Yeah. Looks amazing. Um, you know, is she I'm, home yet or is she still in the hospital? You know, I don't think they keep you. And, and, and being yeah. in this coronavirus situation, like, I want to get the fuck yeah. out of that hospital as quickly as possible. You know what I mean? I, I don't want to risk the chance of anything happening to me or my baby. So right. I, I, I think she got out of there as quickly as possible. I'm not sure I didn't even ask, but I just like, hey, how you doing? She's like, great. How's the baby? Amazing. Let me see some pictures. She sent me a bunch. And um, she's all smiles and, you know, she's ready to rock. That's some great news. That's some great news. Absolutely.